Hello and welcome to another Unity tutorial. In this video we will be creating an implementation of Langton's Ant. Langton's Ant is a two-dimensional universal Turing machine with a very simple set of rules but complex emergent behavior. The ant starts off creating simple patterns and perhaps something symmetrical. After a few hundred steps the ant starts to become chaotic, and eventually what it's doing looks completely random. However around step 10,000 the ant suddenly becomes completely regular. This is a 104 step cycle that just repeats forever. How bizarre. Let's run through the project to see what's going on. On the main camera we have a mouse controller script. This simply spawns a new ant at the mouse position onto the grid. Next we have a map generator object and script that stores reference to an empty tile as well as letting you specify the size of your board. The assets here are very self-explanatory. We have a few materials, prefabs and scripts. Let's look at the ant controller. We are effectively running our own update loop which can be set in the inspector. Whenever the ant's trigger collides with an empty tile we check its condition via the tag and then rotate the ant accordingly. The map generator simply uses some nested loops to generate the board. The board is a multi-dimensional array to store all the positions. At each position of the board we instantiate an empty cell prefab. The cell update script sits on each empty tile. Whenever the ant enters the trigger of the tile we flip its color and update the tag. These colors are material references. Finally we have the mouse controller. This script fires a raycast from the mouse position and spawns a new ant at that location. Utility functions exist to let you zoom in and out of the game view. That's ultimately all there is to it. Please check the GitHub for the complete project files. I hope you found something of value with this video. Please consider subscribing. Thanks again.